you found this video looking for a solution for your Canon battery problem. Now I've got a very simple solution to rescue you from this problem. So probably your camera gives this message, I'm gonna show it right now. Uh, mine's in Dutch, but yours probably in English. And it says something like battery communication error. Does your battery have a Canon logo? Well, you, because you use an original battery, you say yes, it got the original logo and you press yes. And then the, and the camera says, well, we don't think it's the original battery, so we shut down the camera to make sure your camera doesn't get damaged. But it's an original battery. It's not a copy, it's an original battery. Why does your camera say it's, a, it's not an original battery? Well, it is an original battery. Well, therefore we have to grab a battery. So this is the original Canon battery. I've got different batteries because I use my R5s, but I still got the old ones. Uh, this, this battery here, and I'll do it right, like this. But this battery right here and already says COM error because I write down which batteries give the errors because I didn't know what caused the problem. So now I know the solution. What happens in your camera? So your camera has a uh, contact point. So these, these two things over here are the contact points of the camera or the battery, sorry, to the camera. And when you put the battery in, the camera recognizes the original Canon battery and says, OK, let's rock and roll, shoot some photos. In this case, when I put in this battery, it gives this message. It says, no, it's not an original battery, you can't use it. So, I've tried to find out if there's a simple solution. I contacted Canon, because I work with Canon in the Netherlands. I asked them, can you fix it for me? I, uh, and I didn't have a real solution. And then I thought, well, okay, uh, my camera isn't broken. The battery isn't broken, because a lot of batteries of me do it. What's the problem? And then I thought, this probably is way easier than I think to solve the solution. So, and there something very interesting comes in play. This little thing. That's a pencil. And this is a, well, we call it a gum, <laughs> like this. We call it a gum, uh, but in English you call it eraser. And this eraser is gonna erase your problems. And this pencil is gonna help you solve the problem. You don't have to open up the camera, you don't have to do difficult stuff to the camera, software updates, because it isn't a software thing. Well, is it, 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 is, it is a software thing, but it's a software thing that keeps us from using this battery. So you're just gonna erase the battery like this, you're just gonna, just gonna erase it. You're gonna use a eraser and just go over the contact points like this. Really great if you do it really hard, because it's oxidation. So your contact points are just oxidated. Do it like this. And when you um, clean them, because the only thing you do, you clean the batteries, put it in the camera, the problem will be gone. So when I put it in my R5, start it up right here, and you see it immediately starts up. So the light isn't great here because it isn't focused on no problem at all. So I can use it without any problem. So the problem is gone just by using a simple pencil. So if you got contact points problems with any device, just use an eraser to clean the, the contact points and your battery will work again. If you wanna see more of my work, go to my Instagram or to my YouTube or look behind the scenes because I'm a wedding photographer and I photograph all over the world. Um, check me out because I got some cool stuff to, to show you guys and I hope your battery problems are solved. And remember to take a lot of shots, but always stay focused. Thank <laughs> you.